What's going on, guys? It's General Santucci. I'm doing a, uh, a 1v1, 25k. Uh, the only rules were no Ellie, no Art, no Rome, no room, and no artillery. And I picked, I picked Thrace like a freaking lunatic. I'm going against Macedon, which is, has superior infantry, cavalry. Our archers, they have better archers. Everything about my army is... I'm totally the underdog in this uh, thing here. But he look at all the cavalry. He's got six, seven, eight units of cavalry. They're all s severely upgraded. only thing he didn't upgrade was these archers here. No, that doesn't matter to me. Because my archers can shoot his archers, so... Um... My archers are so upgraded, it's unbelievable. I have, um, gold gold and maybe one or two experienced chevrons, depending on, you know, whatever I had left. And my, um, pikemen are fully upgraded. Gold gold, three experienced chevron. These guys are gold gold. Some of them have an experienced chevron, I think. All of them do. And these are gold gold, um, generals, bodyguard. I use them because of their hit points. Um, I'm not going to win a cavalry engagement with them. They're quick, and they are very effective in knocking down units. He moved his cavalry over here, so thus I don't need um, all six flaxmen on the uh, right side. Uh, I use all six on this side, which he left this open. I'm going to send these guys over here, see if what I can do with these archers, if I can have them maybe get them to uh, fall back a little bit or something. He uh, really dropped these guys down to 29 men from like 60, 80 or something like that. I don't know. He's trying to chase me with these guys, which is uh, not going to happen. While he's shooting my cavalry, I'm hitting him to death with my arrows. This is all I wanted them to do, and I know they're going to last a while too. They're not going to drop. They're actually really tough. So he's going to engage with his uh, infantry. You can see he's running this guy over here. He knows he can win an infantry battle against this one. So as you see, I brought all my dudes over here. They're ready for war. If, I, if it takes him going all the way around these dudes to get to here, that means more damage I could do to his uh, archers, which are routing. And uh, maybe bring up the uh, remainder of my cavalry. So right off the bat, let's see what happens. Like I said, uh, well, I actually outnumber his pikes by uh, by one. So I'm going to charge right into him right away. And these guys go flying, too, when that happens. So you got to pull them out. You don't need any of that crap. And while it's happening, every one of my archers are being trained on his cavalry. So I'm moving these guys up, and I need to start moving these guys, too. So he turned his guys around to take on my cavalry, and now is a perfect opportunity to take these guys off guard mode and to engage with his men. So seeing this, I'm going to charge everything. My archers, everything. I need to slow this cav down. If they hit my the rear of my uh, phalanx, I'm done. And while that's going on, I'm routing his pikes. You can see I already got this one out of here. This guy's got nine men left in his unit. I'm turning this one around to face them. He's pretty much done with the phalanx. These guys, they still have a chance at winning this fight over here. But these archers will look like they're going to drop. They're really upgraded. They have the good defense. But he admitted defeat. He knew he wasn't going to win anymore. Because I was going to run around and take their out any ratting troops to stop them from coming back. It's a brutal fight from both sides. But um, good game to uh, Vade. I'm Cosmic. That deployed 762 men and have 464 kills and 65 men remaining. See, I had uh, 871 uh, deployed and 688 
I uh, killed and 471 remaining. Who's my MVP? Let's see if my eyes are working. I got a 67, 69 for General's Armored Bodyguard. They came in handy. Pikemen got their asses whooped, but they still did what they had to do. The Flaxmen did a great job. Everyone got 40 kills, 36 kills. That's ridiculous. Thank God I brought those guys, huh? Guys, I hope you enjoyed this battle. Supposedly this happened in 537 AD in Libya. Um, Macedon must have been uh, pretty powerful. Survived that long and so can the th uh, Thrace. So uh, if you haven't, uh, please subscribe. I love seeing, uh, hey, so-and-so is subscribed to your channel. Comments are awesome. Guys, hope you enjoyed this 25k Denari battle. All that shit could have happened here. But somehow I pulled a victory out of my ASS with Thrace. Peace.